Hey again, so this video is just to show you that once you finish your Edpuzzle assignment, um, I just want to show you how to go ahead and turn that in on Google Classroom. So once you get to the last part of the video lecture, and after, after you've answered all the questions, you'll see off to the side here it says that you are done and you can show your results. So once you click on that, it will show you that you have completed 100% of the video. It will tell you how many correct responses you got. And then it does score you out of 100. That grade's going to be different in progress book. It's not worth 100 points. Um, I just need to figure out how to change it here on Flipgrid. Once you go back to Google Classroom, it will show you that this assignment is graded. Um, which is great, but to turn it in on Google Classroom, you do have to go through one extra step. So you're going to go ahead and click View Assignment. Right here, it is going to tell you again that this is graded, but it's not actually turned in at the moment. It looks a little different on my end. This is my end. It shows that I have one graded assign assignment, but zero turned in. I want everyone to make sure that they mark it here as turned in, just so I know again who has done it and who has not. So to get that extra step on my end, you're gonna go over here after you've clicked view assignment, hit resubmit, and it's gonna say you didn't attach blah, 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 so your teacher will see it's done. Don't worry about that. All I want you to do is hit resubmit, Mark is done, and then that's it. When we now go over to my end, let me refresh my page, it will show that I have one assignment turned in, and then I can go ahead and look at it on Edpuzzle, but I do want you to go through that extra step to turn it in on Google Classroom. So again, I can see who has not completed it and who has.